Hey guys, Salaam Alaikum and welcome back to our channel. Salaam everyone, what's going on? So as you've read the title of the video, today we are going for a doctor's appointment, my 34 week checkup. Yes. I can't believe we're like at the end, at the very it's, end, inshallah. Allah, subhanallah, it's, it's, it's crazy how time is flying. Like right? well, we still can't believe it. Alhamdulillah, Alhamdulillah, what a blessing. I truly look forward to any and every doctor's appointment that has to do with baby boy because I want to know how he's doing. I want to hear his heartbeat. I want to see him on the screen. And luckily today I have an ultrasound. Yes. So we get to see him today, even if it's for a little bit. Um, so I'm really, really excited about that. And then after that, we have a doctor's appointment, like to follow up, with, follow the up with the doctor and <clears throat> just talk about any concerns that we have yeah. um, which you've had a few like the yeah the um, reflex acid reflux, acid reflux. It's, it's really really is it, inconvenient it's called acid reflux yeah i've been calling it reflex this whole time <laughs> um yeah it just it started actually at like 30 weeks yeah for me you're going into close to a month now with it yeah it started around yeah. 30 weeks and it was such a uncomfortable feeling i've never had this feeling before and so it was so strange and so new to me um so i i've gotten that recently and also um i haven't been able to use the bathroom properly recent, and we're going to talk to my doctor about it to see what i can take that's considered safe yeah um, we just here's the thing too with like pregnancy and everything anything that you have if yeah. Omaya wasn't pregnant like we'll go to the pharmacy just get anything off of the shelf right and try but since she is pregnant you have to be very cautious because there's some ingredients that aren't good for the pregnancy for the baby so, so you just have to be aware so that's why ask your ask your doctor before yeah. taking any medicine or anything over the counter just make sure you ask your doctor first so we're gonna talk to her about those two concerns uh, what else what, anything else not really yeah well anyways we're heading to the doctors yes. now and inshallah inshallah we hear good news inshallah baby's doing well inshallah. how you feeling so so excited! Belly's growing. Oh, mashallah, mashallah. We just got our ultrasound done and ultrasound done. Yes. And they said the baby is measuring really big. Alhamdulillah, like alhamdulillah. Six pounds and a half. Alhamdulillah, yeah. <laughs> but still growing, <laughs> mashallah. Alhamdulillah. alhamdulillah. Yeah, so I can't even imagine how much bigger he, he will be when he gets here, inshallah. I just don't want to get hurt. That's like my only yeah. thing. Yeah. Like, Please don't hurt me. No, no, he's going to be a good boy, inshallah. <laughs> Listen to mama. No, we are. I'm so happy that like, we're almost there. Again. Alhamdulillah, time is flying. Allah's making it just easy on us and Amaya. And uh, we're waiting now for the doctor to just kind of let us know the next steps. And we're on our way. Okay, so we're all done with the doctor's visit and it went really well. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. We got to see baby boy. Yay. Uh, we got to ask the doctor all the questions that we had yes. and alhamdulillah we just we gotta make sure my drinks more water more 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 water uh the doctor emphasized you guys when i tell you i've been feeling like i've been drinking a lot a lot of water and it's not enough for this doctor she said it has to be a gallon a day because she asked him why she's like oh, she, this is what she said how much how much water do you drink? And Omaya was like, a lot. And then she's like, what how, like what's a lot? And then she showed her this water bottle. And Omaya's like, two and a half to three of these a day. And the doctor's like, okay, that's nowhere near what you need to be drinking. She's like, you need to be closer to a gallon. Oh. And then Omaya was like, but I have to use the bathroom more. And then they're like, what I'm telling you, two of these a day, like I feel like I'm in the bathroom ten, ten times at least. Ten times in the bathroom. Easy. Maybe more. Um, and the fact that she's saying that that's not enough, that I have to up it up to a gallon, I'm like, woman, no one's gonna see me. I'll be living in the bathroom. I might as well just like take my laptop and my freaking pillow and blanket and just stay there because I'll be there all day. And I'm not joking, I'm not exaggerating. You've seen it. How many times, how many times do I wake up at night? I think four. You're, well, you're sleeping, you don't even notice. What I it. notice is like three or four. Yeah. What I noticed. Actually, more than that. Oh, man. Like last night, four. Four times. Some nights, five times. I always tell like, do you need some help? And I'm just like, I, I'm like, do you need some help? And I'm like, please say no. I'm too tired. <laughs> but anyways, um, yeah. So she did say I have to drink more water. 
she did recommend um, something for me to take in order to be able to use the bathroom, yes. like number two. And um, as far as acid reflux, she just said Pepsi that works, see, um, Tums, Tums works. Work. Um, yeah, whatever. I mean, Those ones. whatever I take is still not removing that feeling. Yeah, um, we discussed labor and the pain and uh, my options. The thing is, I don't know if if I want to tough it up and push through and not use any medication yeah. uh, for contractions or if I just want to like use the medication so I don't have to feel all that pain. I still haven't made up my mind yet. Um, so I'll talk to you guys a little bit about that maybe on another video when we're getting closer and I get an idea of what I want to do. But honestly, yeah. I just don't want to feel pain. I don't. I know. At all. Um, but You're then. Gonna be good, baby. Don't worry. Yeah, I know. Don't but then some people out. are like, you could do this. Like, we're meant for this. Like, at least try. So I'm like going back and forth. I have no idea. I we guess. We some time. Yeah, we have well, some time. Not I think. a lot, but a little bit. <laughs> but right now. You can tell our energy is like dying. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> so we're going to get some food. And then afterwards, we're going to... Oh, you're okay? Yeah. Oh, you're really tired. We just started to. <laughs> um, but afterwards, we're, we're going to stop at a baby store and look for car seats and yes. stroller. Yes. I'm excited. I'm super excited. Are you excited about food? Yeah. <laughs> I always make my side of this Okay, so we just got to the baby store and we're here to look for a car seat and a stroller. Yes. Amaya has gave me <laughs> like some different brands. There's Nuna, there is, wow, there's wow. Nuna, there's Bi- uh, no. There's Nuna. Yes. And there is... Up a baby. Up a baby. And there's so, another one called Bugaboo, I think. Bugaboo is new to me. Yeah. So pretty much our decision is going to come down between one of those three. Yes. So... Uh, I think most likely, I think most likely it will be the Up a baby just because... Yep. Um, inshallah, inshallah, we're hoping to have another baby. Inshallah. Um, we're planning for baby number two as well. Inshallah. So we would like to have a stroller that could put like... That can that you can add another yeah. kid to. The good thing is, as soon as we walked into the store, Maya and I were like, "Whoa, they got a lot they of options." They have everything, not just strollers yeah. or car seats. They have clothes, they yeah. have bibs, they have everything, everything and, you could possibly need. And we're in Orlando, yes. so sometimes like the stores here are bigger than Tampa. So right behind you are all of the strollers. Um, so we are gonna look um, at each and every one of them and make our decision today because we're only like six weeks or seven weeks away. Yeah. Seven, six weeks. I don't know how many time, weeks. Time flying. Yeah, so we sure. need to walk out with something today. Yeah, we're going to walk out with two things. <laughs> okay, so right now we are in the Nuna section. Yes. And this stroller is so beautiful. So it's really nice and we like the color a lot. The only thing is, as Omaya mentioned, we're planning inshallah, inshallah, we're having a second baby. Yeah. We're not a fan of having the second baby kind of be like... All the way at the bottom. All the way at the bottom. We love the idea of having like one here and then yes. one up here. This so, one is just a little like awkward. Yeah, let me show them. them Hold on. The bottom, yeah. But then the second kid is all the way down here. Look. Or I think it would be the opposite. I think the 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 newborn or the, yeah. the, the younger one yeah. up here and then. The I don't know. Older it's just like an awkward placement, I feel. It's just tight. Like it's it's like, a little tight, yeah. And, and that's where the upper baby like it gets advantage on gets this. that advantage, yeah. yeah. But what about if it's just for one single baby? If it's for just one single, I, I would go for the Nuna. For some reason, I like the Nuna style a little bit more. It's like more sleek. I don't know. Yeah, and the wheels are, they look really cool. What about pricing? Pricing wise, is very competitive. It's the same. Similar? Yeah. Look at the price for this one. Is I think it's at the bottom right there. Yeah, so this one, it says $8.99 for the stroller. Oh, $8.99. It said the sibling seat starting at $2.49. Oh, so $8.99 plus the other seat. So you're talking about like, oh yeah, a grand plus. It's yeah, it's similar little... to Upper Baby. Yeah. Very, very similar. So the other thing is when you remove the second seat, you have more space down here. Yeah. And it's easy to move. And yeah. this is all space. But the problem is, is when you, have the second. when you have the second child, you don't have that space. Yeah. 
So you're gonna have to have like a, yeah. a bag with you everywhere. You're gonna have to carry something with you. Yeah, because you can't just quite hold, hold the child like this. And then, like, you know, <laughs> you're gonna have to this going here. Yeah. And, not, and more likely, I'm the one that's gonna be carrying the other bag. Yeah. So let's put this back. This is easy, huh? It's easy to put. I ain't gonna lie, though. Yeah, Getting they make it so easy. Let's go look at the other one. So this is the upper baby yes. that we're thinking about getting. And Mo, you want to show them how it looks, like the storage? Okay, now this is what I was talking about. Now the new now, when you have this part at the back, you lose the storage. Yeah. But the way that this one's placed is so convenient because you can still use this bottom part, right? Yeah. So because of this reason, I think it's best to go with this one. To go with this one. Remove the bottom part again and this is how we would be using it right now or when baby boy gets here inshallah that's exactly how it's light too. yeah it's super light i think it's lighter than the nuna i think this one's lighter than the nuna yeah maya what are you doing <laughs> so as we we're looking at the strollers here i realized they're super overpriced yeah and then i looked at them online oh god it's, it's like a lot cheaper like, show me it's not a lot cheaper but like 150 200 dollars cheaper damn um, to get it online than to buy from here buy it from here so i'm ordering it online let's just see how fast it comes yeah that's the only thing oh okay oh, no. two to five days oh let's get out of here <laughs> But at least we we got to see it and like yeah yeah we tested yeah we tested it out. But hold up, that's for what is that for? But I'll we need it. It's literally the same thing that's here. But it's we like, need it. We came exactly. in for a stroller and a car seat. Yeah, so that's after we're done with the stroller. Okay. We'll look at the car seats and okay. compare pricing online okay. versus. Okay. All right, guys. So give us like two minutes. Let's figure out what we're gonna do, and then I'll show you the car seats. Okay, we're back in the Nuna section. Yes. Looking at car seats. Nuna Peppa Light. Okay, so this is their infant car seat. This one is much more expensive than the Uppa Baby. Mm -hmm. Let's see, how does this go? Oh, it has magnets on the side. Oh, that's cool. It is. Aww. Is this why it's more expensive than $200? <laughs> I have no idea. Yeah. I mean, it's very like. It's very cute. Yeah. It's really cute. I like it a lot. Well, the other one's but it looks, too. yeah, it's, it's very okay. similar to the other one, yeah. honestly. And I don't, I'm not a big fan about like uh, mixing brands. Right. Yeah. I'm so we pretty much just got the stroller, the bassinet, and the second seat online just literally five minutes ago. Yeah. So we're excited for that to come yes. in. And then now what we're shopping for is the car seat. Yeah. So. I'm thinking we're gonna we're leaning towards more of the upper baby one. Yes, because, because we don't want to mix we don't brands. Mi mix and match a lot of the brands, and also the other one is better price, and it's it does the same thing. Yeah, it does the same. Thing. All right, so we just left the baby store. Uh, mm -hmm. Pretty much. We got what we needed, but not from the store. We got everything online. As we're speaking, Muhammad is buying the car seat online. <laughs> it's too funny because we, we drove all the way out here to buy a stroller, a car seat, a bassinet. And we literally just got everything online. And everything. we just walked out with like a, a monitor. Yeah, we got the baby monitor, the nanit. A recommendation because I literally just learned this from Amaya. When you're shopping, especially for baby stuff, look online. To yeah. see the price unless you need it like the next day go to the store check it out see how it functions but don't buy it if it's cheaper online you know what i mean you save I mean, yourself some money yeah because this stuff's expensive oh my god it wow. adds up so much man i did not think we were gonna spend this much but at least we saved some money by ordering it online and the shipping is free so it worked out for us um plus it'll take like three days three business days for it to arrive home we don't need it right now no. instantly it would have yeah. been nice to have it and like yeah. unbox it later on when we got home but it is okay i mean yeah. the baby's not due until 
yeah six seven weeks from ordering now. it from the store would have been like two weeks oh yeah that's another thing yeah. ordering anything at that store at least the stuff that we liked yeah um it wasn't available to take with us immediately we would have had to wait either way yeah so it just worked out perfectly Alhamdulillah. um did you get the car seat yeah it's done it's done yeah so we always just order it right now <laughs> okay so. so at least now we have a car seat stroller with seat. an extra seat yeah. and a bassinet yes right so we mm -hmm. have a lot yeah. um and i'm aware that we're doing the most i'm gonna be honest with you guys like you know with our first baby like uh this is new to us but at the same time like uh we're, we're we just want to buy and make sure we're as prepared as possible yeah now i say that and i know people are always going to be like you can't prepare for this stuff you just figure it out as you go we know that but we're just trying you know yeah, there's yeah. going to be a lot of stuff where we're like oh man we're missing this there is no reason why we should buy this yeah we'll, i guess we'll, we'll learn, learn yeah. eventually one thing you guys the video makes it seem like we were in the store for like 20 minutes or 30 minutes but we legit stayed in there for like two hours and a half maybe three because we were just looking at everything that they had we also filmed a tiktok video while we were there yeah um <laughs> so i am well we are so tired yeah. And so hungry. Yeah. The sun's literally setting right behind. It me. is. It <laughs> is gets, setting. Like we came here, it was bright, and now it's like setting. And she's hungry. She needs to eat. So yeah. I gotta. We gotta you, figure something out. When on when you are in Orlando, you gotta go Latin food because yeah. they got the best Latin food, especially Venezuelan. So I gotta get on my Google, figure out where I'm gonna yes, feed her. I want arepa, y pequeños, pequeños, arepa, empanada, y empanada. Uh, cachapa. Y cachapa. Uh, y, y fresco, fresco, fresco en Malta. Oh my eh, god. Eh, Let's find a Venezuelan. This is the magic sauce right here. It's the best sauce ever. Excuse the noise. <laughs> so we have some pequeños. Inside is cheese. And the way we eat it, we dip it in this green sauce. Oh, you Just like that. Here. Here. No, you eat it. No, bro. you eat it. No. There we go. Sure. Alright, what are we drinking? Oh my god, so good. Homemade passion fruit. Oof. So delicious. I'm so happy right now.